and welcome back guys to my walkthrough and so now after defeating Price for my seventh gym badge we will now fly over to Goldenrod City over to the radio tower to, to take out all these rockets so we um, we need to go underground where this rocket will dress you like a grunt. Like what? That never happened in gold, silver, and crystal. But anyways, going down, and we will now meet the rocket grunt who will disguise you as one of them so that you can get up the stairs. But why he did that, I will never know. And like, yay, I'm a rocket grunt! I'm a Team Rocket member! Like, now I'm gonna go steal some trainers' Pokemon, and I'm gonna spread Team Rocket evil all known around the world. I'll make sure people know Team Rocket. But it's only short-lived, though. Of course, that's a big LOL right there. As then the rival shows up and says that it's an imposter. He says that it's me and takes off the clothing and reveals that it is me as the grunt is shot. And so now we commence the battle. As he sends in Eradicate and Omphoros will start yet again as I Thunder Punch it. As I send in my Sand Slash now. As he's a scary face, and then I will use Crush Claw. And then he'll use Crunch to do a little bit of damage. I use Roll Out, which I could have just used another Crush Claw, but I use a Sucker Punch, and I finish it with a Roll Out. Pretty simple, really. All these other rocket grunts are pretty easy as well, so yeah. So then the, uh, the rival leaves, and we will continue making our way through the radio tower. You can avoid a few of these rocket battles if you want, but if you want the experience, then just go ahead and battle them. So now we face this rocket grunt that has five pretty easy Pokemon to beat. It's, it's just pretty simple. Plenty of... And then uh, there's my little female Eevee. I've had a few people uh, tell me what Pokemon I want to evolve my Eevee into. Well, I'm probably going to evolve it into an Espeon first. And I'm going to use it for the Pokemon League after I get my 8th badge. And then I plan to breed it with one of my Pokemon and get another female Eevee egg so that I can get all the Eevee evolutions. Although, I don't know if I can get Leafeon or Glaceon. Uh, myself uh, in here, un unless I think I can use a leaf stone on it. But, um, so yeah, so I'll probably evolve it to an Espeon first. So I just pretty much use Fly against the rest of these Pokemon. As he's 
Hyper Fang, which misses, of course, because I'm flying, and takes that out. Uh, sends in another Rattata. As I fly up again. And putting an end to that Rattata. Although I will make a couple of adjustments to my Pokemon team now before I even enter the Pokemon League. I would like to get a Dragon Pokemon. Probably a uh, Dragonite if I can uh, get a hold of one. I should be able to get a Dratini in the Dragon's Den whenever I make my way into Blackthorn. When I head into the Dragon's Den. So, that Rocket Grunt is now defeated, and we can move on. And now we will take on this Rocket Grunt. So, yeah. And I hope to get these parts up quicker for you guys, too. So... Anyways, use a smoke screen. Coffee Co 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 uses a smoke screen. Misses. Or it hits and uh, use Thunder Punch and it misses. Uses smoke screen again and I decide to use Discharge. As my Ampharos will now bump up to level 36. Or 37, I mean. As he gets ready to send in Grimer, I will switch to my Quilava. As it's close to evolving into a Typhlosion. As I use Lava Plume. As sends in a weak Rattata for me to take out. Although, like I said before, I do not plan on evolving my Quilava until level 42 because it learns Flamethrower at 42. And I'm gonna need Flamethrower to replace Flame Wheel because Flamethrower is stronger than Flame Wheel. So, now we will battle one more Grunt in this part. So, sends in Zubat and. And on for us again we'll start. And thunder punching it. Taking it out. Ready sending Grimer, I will switch back to Quilava to bump it to level 36. As I will use Lava Plume. And take it out, and my Kalava will bump up to level 36. But again, I will not let it evolve into a type lotion until level 42 so that I can learn Flamethrower. Because otherwise, uh, type lotion doesn't learn it until like level 54. So, Lava Plume and Burn Skull Bat, and we'll. Go down in this turn. Well, guys, uh, thank you all for watching this uh, my walkthrough, and look for more walkthroughs here in just a little bit. So make sure to comment, rate, and subscribe. Make sure to comment, rate, and subscribe, and do it now. All right. Well, guys, um, that'll do it for this walkthrough, guys. So until the next walkthrough, guys. Later.